Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Allie and I love a good DIY project, simple living, and making a house into a home on a budget. One project in my house that's been needing some love for a while is my upstairs bathroom. So it's our main bathroom. Um, we have a split level, so we live like upstairs in our house um, mostly. And our bathroom just really needed like some, just like a little refresh. but. Um, as always, I love to do things on a budget, so I ran to Goodwill, and I um, spent $30, and I totally refreshed it using just a few things I had at home, um, some paint I already had, and a few other things, and then I added in my Goodwill items. So all those things put together, it looks totally different, just so refreshed and way more practical, and um, it only took me two years, but I'm really excited because I, I finally feel like it has like purpose. So I'm gonna walk you guys through part of the process of refreshing it and then you'll get to see the final product at the end. So um, stick around and let's jump into it. So while thrifting I found this curtain but it wasn't wide enough. Um, I liked the idea though. I found this, I'm not even sure what it was, maybe a bed skirt. Um, but it, it, I just wasn't sure what it was gonna be like once I opened it up and I wasn't sure if it would work for a shower curtain. Um, so I just left that one behind. Um, this one was the winner. It's just a top sheet for a bed, probably a queen size, and it has a lace detail at the bottom, and I really liked this one. I found these shelves. It was a set of two, and it was so simple to just like take them home and hang them up. Um, so I was really tempted to get them, but they weren't deep enough for storage, and we really needed storage. Um, I wanted to put some baskets on the top of the shelves, so I found a bunch of good options, um, but... I ended up not getting the white shelves because none of these would fit. Um, I did get this basket and it looks really cute. And this is the total of what I spent. Okay, here's the before of the bathroom. Um, I'm excited to refresh it. I am planning above the toilet right here doing some shelves. Um, probably just one shelf because of the board and batten. I'll probably just do one above it. And then I got some baskets from Goodwill to put on the shelf. Um, I would love to get rid of this second mirror someday, but I need to learn how to drywall first. Um, I did refresh the walls with a new coat of white paint that I already had, so I just buy the same color in a gallon and just keep it around the house and then replace it when it's done. That way I just have that, that white color that I like. I also got a new shower curtain, kind of. I actually got... Um, some fabric to make a shower curtain because I think I just want to mix it up a little bit so if I change my mind and leave the blue one then that's what I do but um, I think that's everything for now I decided to just hang one shelf because of the board and batten and because I only had two brackets of the ones that I wanted to use so I had these IKEA brackets left over from another project so I just painted them and decided to use those here and here are the brackets hung on the wall. To give the bathroom a more cohesive and just open, like bigger feel, I decided to paint the brackets and the shelf white just so it didn't take up as much visual space. As always, if you enjoyed this video, please subscribe. I post a new video just like this every Friday, and along with that is a blog post that correlates. So um, I would love to see you back here. Thanks so much for watching. Hope you guys have a great week.